Form Mule is an excellent add-on for mail merging. I will be using it in conjunction with information I am collecting via a form. When students request an appointment with a teacher, I want it to email that teacher automatically, and I'll use Form Mule to do this. First, you will need Form Mule in your Sheets add-ons. If you don't have it, choose Get Add-ons and search for Form Mule. Once installed, simply launch Form Mule from your add-ons menu. The Form Mule Wizard will open, which will walk you through the merge process. First, choose a spreadsheet tab that Form Mule should reference. My spreadsheet only has one tab, but I still need to use the drop down menu to select it. Next, I need to set my triggers for when I want Form Mule to run. If you plan to manually run your merge, you do not need to set up a trigger, but I want mine to run whenever someone fills out my form, so I will toggle the trigger to run on Form Submit. Click Next. Here is where you can set up different email templates. I only need one template, so I will leave this exactly how it is and choose Save Template Settings. After I do that, I can now edit my template, which is the email response that Formule will send. All of these merge tags along the right correspond to column headers on my spreadsheet, which makes it really easy to insert a merge field. I want the email to be sent to the teacher, so I will click in the To field and add the merge value that says select your teacher's email address. If you wanted your email to be sent back to the person who filled out the form, you would instead choose the email that the form collected. When teachers reply to a student's request for an appointment, I want that to go directly to the student, not back to me. So I will click in the Reply To field and put in the merge tag for the email address of the person who filled out the form, in this case the student. If you needed all replies to go to a certain person, you could just type that person's email in this field, or you can enter something like do not reply at email.com. I will add a subject line, and to make it easier for teachers to manage multiple appointment requests, I will add the student's name to the subject. Now you can just type whatever text you need in the body of the email and add merge tags to customize it. When I add tags to the body of the email form, you'll also inserts the column header text. It is fine to change any of the text outside these brackets or carrots, but leave the bracketed fields alone. Those are the merge fields. I'm going to just leave the text as it is to show you how to preview and return to edit it. When you think you're done creating your template, just click Save and Send All. This will pull up a preview. In my preview, I can see that that column header text that was pulled in with the merge field is a little confusing. Your name, for example, doesn't need to be there. I just need the student's name. So I will click Edit Template and adjust some of the phrasing to make the email more readable. After you've made any necessary changes and previewed, just click Send Now to start the merge. A couple people already filled out my form before I set up this email merge, so those two emails will be sent right now. As others fill out the form, Form Mule will automatically send the request onto the teacher since I set Form Mule to run whenever someone fills out my form. Form Mule will also add a column to your spreadsheet so you can see the status of your merge, and any errors such as undeliverable emails will show up here in red. Form Mule makes email merges from a spreadsheet very easy and can be used in conjunction with Google Forms to provide even more uses.